Wake up with fresh morning breath naturally. Dentiste, a premium natural toothpaste that works overnight. Use at night and wake up with fresh morning breath in just one use. Try it now on your preferred online store like Lazada. Hi, Sky Fam. I am Scotty. And today we're going to learn about monster truck. Hey, babe, I thought you wanted to join our podcast because we're going to talk about love. We want to talk about monster truck and not talk about love. <laughs> <laughs> But our topic for today is about love. And I told Scotty that you can join us for a little bit because later on we're going to be talking about love. And Scotty said, I have a lot to say about love. Do you have a lot to say about love, Scott? Like I love you. Uh, yeah. What, what does love feel like? Love feels like we're becoming friends. What else? What <laughs> yeah. else? You hug them, that's love. That is love. When you hug, that's love? Yeah. Can I ask you, who is the person that you love the most in the whole wide world? Eh, uh, mommy and daddy. Blippi and daddy? No, mommy and daddy. <laughs> <laughs> what about Toby? And Toby and Yaya and Scotty, everyone. Oh. Mm. When mommy and daddy give you love, what do you feel? I feel happy. Mm. How do we show love to you, Scotty? What do we do that makes you feel like we love you? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. How do you show us that you love us? We hug them and we kiss them. <laughs> okay. And when I give you a surprise, that's love. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Really? A surprise like flowers. Do you flowers. think that you'll ever love somebody when you're bigger that isn't mom or dad? No. I like it to be mom and dad. What if you love someone that can become your partner? They'll love you. Oh, you'll still love us, but you can also love somebody else, right? You want somebody else to be your wife and you're big, right? But I'll still love you. Oh, you're so special, my love. But what if you're dead, Mama? <laughs> what if we're dead? Yeah. You what? can still love us even if we're dead, just like we visit the cemetery and remember the people that are gone already. You still love them even if they're gone. But if you're gone, I'll, I'll be sad. Hey, don't worry about it. We're not going to be gone for a very long time, okay? <laughs> you're it's so, okay, though. You're so Mommy mature. and Daddy will be here for you. Yeah. We'll take care of you, our baby. But what if Mommy and Daddy is dead now? Babe, we're not going to die, hopefully, until you're very old already. You're going to be as old as Dad or older. Okay? So you don't have to worry. That's a lot more years. You know, we still have to go to the Monster Truck Stadium. You still have to get yourself a wife and little babies that mommy can take care of. <laughs> <laughs> That's sad. That went south so quick. <laughs> Dong, do you do you, can, do you want to have babies when you're old also? Yeah. How many babies do you want? Five. Five, Five babies. So many. Do you want boys or girls? Girls. What oh, are you gonna girls? teach your your babies about? Um, monster trucks. About monster <laughs> trucks, <laughs> Yeah. What else? About racing. Mm. And racing. Are you going to teach them about love? Yeah. yeah. How Are will you going to love them? Yeah. Yeah. How will you teach them about love? I'll say, I love you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mommy and daddy na food podcast. I'll see you later, sweetheart. Thank you for joining us today. I'll be you later, alligator. I'll see and you later. White crocodile. crocodile. Give a hug, ladybug. Out the door, dinosaur! <laughs> okay, out the door, dinosaur. Bye! Bye, Dong. Thank you for joining the podcast. Yeah. Bye-bye. Yeah. All right. <laughs> All Special right. guest, Scotty Boo. I know. He really wanted to join us this morning. In fact, while we were setting up, Oh. Kinuha na niya yung mic. And then dami na niya. You know what was surprising? <laughs> what? Na niya? Like, it wasn't recording, pero I think you got it on yourself. Yeah, yeah, he just went up to our mics na naka standby lang dun. And then sabi niya, Hi, my name is Scotty Boo. I'm a boy. And I love monster trucks. Tapos may mga intro pa siya. And dami niyang spiel. And today, I'm gonna sing a song for you. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, how the heck did he come up with this in his brain? Yep. He's been listening to us too many times, I think. To you, mostly. To me. <laughs> But, but anyway, our topic for today is love and not the kind of love that we usually talk about. It's actually the cringy kind of love <laughs> that we are also guilty of. Oh, yes. alam mo yung mga intimate love moments wherein couples have? Hindi lang siya intimate. 
cringy talaga siya. Oh, so well, sometimes um, publicly, sometimes hindi. Sometimes. Yeah, like for example, love. Um, I was just watching an old video of mine mm. way back when we had just gotten married. Okay. And every time you're on the vlog, my voice changes. Talaga? Yeah. Like how? What, what happened? Like baby voice siya. <laughs> like baby talk, oh, can you come here? Which is actually how I talk to you talaga, right? Mm, okay. That's, how, that's really how I talk to you like when I want to be cute or whatever. But like, hindi ako nahiya to show it on the vlog. And it's cringy, right? Like I know a lot of people at that time commented like, oh my God, you always baby talk when you're with your husband. And they were like, yeah, relate. I do that too. <laughs> <laughs> so I know it's not just me. Cringy talaga siya. Like me looking back at that video, I was like, oh my God, this is so embarrassing. But it is what it is. It's a, it's a couple cringe love thing. Do you think like other people find it like cringy when you're watching other people do it? Is it cringy? Um, honestly, I see my friends do it all the time. I don't really mind. I mean, kanya kanya, right? I don't judge. But I know... Like, I understand why people would find it cringy. Because I found myself cringy. <laughs> <laughs> I think it depends on the person. It depends on the person you on how they do it Mm-mm. and how you feel towards them. If they don't want them in the first place, like anything they do can be like, parang magnified. Oh. So, ah, ito talaga si Chris. Um, ganyan talaga mag baby talk nakakainis. Pero hindi lang ako, ikaw din. Nag nagbe baby talk oh, ako oh, sa. Oh, when you respond to me, baby talk rin. Oh, cuz yeah, maybe. Yeah, so parang but feeling not as ko, much siguro. Not as much, but but meron pa rin. Like but, we don't nag- talk like this, for sure. Yeah. And I feel like it's something that when you're just starting out with your relationship, like you don't notice these things that you do. Yes. Right? But I think over time, <laughs> nag evolve naman. I think we're yeah. a lot less that. Yeah, of course. I mean, dalawa na rin anak natin. Dami natin pinagdaanan. But sometimes you still do it though. Like, I still do it. Like when I want to be cute or when I want to make lambing. Mm, diba? Mm. You also sometimes. Pero feeling ko hindi na natin napapansin. Yeah. And although we don't want to admit it, normal talaga siya guys. <laughs> Siguro pag single ka, and then your friends do this in front of you. Annoying. Yeah. Annoying siya. Annoying or siya. like you'll call your friends out. Ah, grabe naman kayo. Yeah. Ma, my, my love life. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Your friends, since mm. like you're all guys, right? You usually like give each other a hard time for things like this. Like okay. I remember you guys had this friend who was so vocal about how, he, how much he loved his wife or, or girlfriend at that time mm-hmm. and would like profess it through the captions of his Instagram posts. Oh, right? okay, yeah. Or like the girl would actually screenshot his messages and post it mm. on Instagram. And it was so cringy for you to watch because he's such a guy's guy and then suddenly he's like lover boy <laughs> and being all sweet, right? Yes. So parang, if it's so out of character, I think that's when it becomes cringy. I think there's a fine line. Like, there's a fine line wherein you post about your significant other online. But meron ding yung super dami mga quotable quotes. And ano na, I find personally medyo cringy. Dep- yeah, Slater's not the type to be sweet. Depends on the execution and depends on the person. If you know this person to be like, yun, like you know this person to be not that type of person and bigla na lang siyang um, nagsisend ng mga quotes love quotes oh, you are the star you are the sun you are the moon lahat ng ganon oh, or kaka break up lang and then nakikita mo lahat ng mga mga parinig posts Uh-oh. online so Uh-oh. yun din yung isang cringy thing that Slater and I do I think you guys all know but we never like wanna talk about it we never wanna share because it's so cringy what? Is our pet name for each other? Oh, si Chris mahilig sa pet names, and a lot of people ask me like, "What does that mahilig mean?" And, I, sa, yeah, I'm and I don't like explaining <laughs> it, like, kasi parang ang cringe talaga, ang cringe talaga, and it's all si Chris. Is it? Yeah. It started I off mean, with you. Then, hello, just like Sevi, he's now like Tobias. So, <laughs> so se- far, seven to Sevi, and Sevi to Toby. To Tebby. Uh, Tebby, then naging yung Toby, and naging yung Tobias. <laughs> yeah. Tobster, Tobias, mm. uh, Tebu, so many names. Yep. So, mahilig talaga ako sa, crin- sa, sa cringe. <laughs> <laughs> mahilig talaga ako sa pet names. And with Slater, we had so many, like, we call each other love, which mm. is not so cringy. But we also call each other love of my life. Oh, no. nahiya na siya. Like, <laughs> like, okay lang sa akin if it's like the, the, two, the two of us. Two of us. Yeah. Yeah, but it doesn't fit his scene. Or like, or pag you ka ng letter, and then, oh, yeah, you can be super, super sweet. Uh-oh. And then, yeah. Pero pag may ibang tao na sa room, para up, oh, engineer ako. Ano ka dyan? <laughs> <laughs> no, hindi naman. It's just like, okay, this is just for us. Uh-oh. Mas intimate lang. And then, 
it kind of like became it gets carried over to your normal life right? yes so, so like it's love of, of my life became like l-o-m-l yeah so lomal yeah and then lomal became Romer. Wamo, Wamer. Because you know, you're so cute. Ka. Uh, no, no, no. Sobrang cringy. Yeah, si Chris lang talaga to. Yeah, it's, it's all me. But hello, sumunod ka. So, gusto mo rin. Si Chris lang talaga to. Ayoko aminin. <laughs> <laughs> gusto mo rin. Now, he, we call each other Roms now, for short. But it's yes. just like an evolution of names, which I feel like is so normal. Like, all of our friends have it also. Like, Baba. Oh, yeah, diba? like, yeah, so yeah, many, yeah, yeah. Everybody has it. Nobody just wants to admit. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah. Mas maintindihan mo pa yung mga baba eh. Pag mga romer na parang, Roms, ha? Yeah. Saan ang galing yun? I know, everybody asks us, like, yeah. what is wrong? And meron pa nga Lito, Lita. Yeah. That you actually did. And then parang, Yeah, I don't know. I don't even remember why I call you Lito. But whenever we have a group chat with people, especially on Telegram, mm. they're like, who the heck is Lito? And I'm like, oh, it's later. <laughs> yeah. Because it's a phone so number, yun 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 Girlfriend of. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yung, yeah. yung dating hindi mo close. <laughs> yeah, or like you were introduced by this person. So it's like, yeah. Yes. Funny, uh, funny. Yeah. Ano pa yung mga cringe love? Yung mga ano naman? Galing sa'yo naman. I, like, I hate talking about cringe things. <laughs> um, I feel like guys are generally more embarrassed about it because it like takes away from your macho image. Hindi naman siya macho image. Like, parang I see these things as more intimate like things and like <laughs> he's having the hardest time oh and yung mga ah uh, <laughs> um ikaw 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 we'll start wala ba isip um I don't think this is a cringe thing but it's something that we do in private mm. I feel like one of the reasons why I knew that ikaw na talaga is because for some reason, our wavelength is just so similar, mm-hmm. right? So sometimes we'll be sitting across each other in a room and something will happen. Mm. And then we'll just kind of look at each other in the eye and, and the not, not the really end. say anything. Yeah. And then like we we totally get what each other means already. Mm-hmm. And then later in the car, we're like debrief. What just happened? <laughs> la, la, la. And then we're like both on the same page all the time. Oh. It's not so cringy, but like it's something that we do in private that mm. like nobody else knows. Well, sa akin, itong mga public cringe moments, medyo mas, mas naiilang ako, especially when I'm sharing it to you. Like, I don't even... Naiilang like, nga siya sa akin. What more to you guys? Yeah, I mean, like, <laughs> I tend to be mas ganyan yung emotional. Yeah. Ano ko. yeah. In short, manhid. <laughs> yeah, but mga, al- alam ko, mga, meron tayong mga intimate na cringe moments. Hindi naman siya cringe, but like, Super comfy moments that become cringe because, like, for example, Chris, mahilig na siya umotot sa harap ko. <laughs> <laughs> like, you do this all the time. Yeah, I do. Now. Like, you don't I, even care. I don't even care. Sometimes I even call you, like, wait for it. <laughs> when we were first dating, parang pinipigilan mo ba yung mga otot mo? Like, <laughs> just, like, really. Honestly, like, I didn't fart before. <laughs> There was no fart in my system before. <laughs> and then when I gave birth... No, no, no. no seriously. You definitely farted no, before. Obviously, I farted, but it was a normal fart. But then now, after I gave birth, I'm like, what is going on? It's like... Brr, 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 brr. <laughs> and I, it, she's across the room and I can still hear her. Like, <laughs> no, love. Yesterday, he was like, grab it. I heard that. I'm like, the fuck? That wasn't me. Like, grab it. All the sound. I'm like, you really are. I'm like, I'm sure. <laughs> Dahil ganito, when we were first dating, ang style ko kasi, pag nautot na ako, like, Labas ka muna. No, I just love. Um, uh, let me stand across the room or let me stand outside the room. Yeah, we used to do that. Wait lang. Like, I, hini-heads up ko talaga. Utot lang ako. It's as if like, umiihi lang ako. Wait lang. Diyan ka lang ha. <laughs> utot muna ako. Yeah, and then, we used to do that. And then, si Chris would be like, um, yuck, yuck, kadiri, kadiri, kadiri. Like, para Sa akin, ha? Huh? Parang hindi ka naman umuotot. Hindi talaga. Wala akong otot. <laughs> and then, she would start doing it and following me. Yeah. But ngayon talaga, yeah. without warning, boom, <laughs> yeah. boom, boom. 
Because in my head, girl, you planted a baby inside my stomach and I had to go through that. You have to go through my farts that are a result of this child in fatulence. Oh, and dami, <laughs> and dami talagang mga ganyan. When you're still dating, and dami mga pa demure demure. Yeah. Which is sakto naman din kasi ayaw mo namang like in, in the first date. Like, <laughs> it's just for it. Naotot ka talaga. Wait lang si R muna ako. Tapos Let it rip CR on your first on. date. <laughs> but you know, I have a friend who I think her mom gave her this advice to never poop in front of her partner. Mm. Ever. Like that was her Ever. mom's advice to kind of like keep things mysterious, keep things parang may ano pa kayo with each other. Like there's a space between you guys. Mm. So then you still get excited and you know, it's like because Tayo, like over oh, so comfy. We will have a full blown conversation while someone's pooping. Like nobody cares. Oh, this is Chris. <laughs> kahapon, like we, we we went on a dinner and then sabi niya malaki naman yung CR. Sabi niya ah, sabay na tayo mag-CR. Like para sa akin, like uh, I'd rather wait outside. Yeah, dude, like, I don't care. Like what's the point? Like you just I, like me watching you pee. I mean, okay lang dito sa bahay pero sa in a public space like parang um, that's my thinking. I don't know. It's weird because with me and my girlfriends, like if there's a public CR that's huge, like we'll just go in and all pee together. Like it doesn't matter. Like I'm not watching her yeah, pee. But like why do I have to go into the CR with you? Now I can just I'll just wait outside instead of waiting inside. So, no, 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 I don't mind. You. Whatever. To me, it's just like you're welcome. I am part of you. You're part of me. Kind of like that. Uh, dito sa bahay no problem. Like, yeah. Pero si Chris, pag Pag na number Ay, two siya. na ba to ng secrets, no, guys? Na, na number two to siya. Ay, Cringe. Ano to ha? Love things. Hindi na to siya like... Oh. It's not about pooping and farting, please. Cringe is like the part of the kadiri <laughs> things that we do. <laughs> no, when you're like, super, like, super comfortable with a person. Pero si Chris, hindi pa rin niya kayang mag number two in front of me. Like, yes. you're always saying like, oh, I'm going to Yeah, out. yeah. But ako... Hindi ako comfortable, but she would talk in front of me while I'm doing it. Like, love, love. And then she would complain. You would complain it, about... Yeah. But in like, my I, defense... I just want to talk to you. I have to... I'm like, no, no, this can't wait. Yeah. Because in my defense, this guy, when he's on the toilet, takes an hour. And then he's like on the toilet all day. So no. Like, <laughs> that's our me time. You know, nga. You know, Kaya space nga. namin. Kaya nga. Oh. So para ang tagal-tagal ko maghintay, di ba? Like, I really want to sleep. I'm just going to say this. Ah, pero try mo. Try mo na. Nasa harap mo yung tao. <laughs> kausap mo. Tapos kailangan mong mag-exert ng <laughs> effort. Sobrang tagal yung talaga mag- <laughs> Poop. So, ako kasi when I go in, like, I have to go. So, I'm like in and out. So, then I'm like, okay, get out first and I'll talk to you outside. No. no yeah. Like, no. It's my it's my private space. <laughs> I think I love... And, and like, we're talking about, lagyan mo natin ng pintuan yung, 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 do, yung, ano natin, uh, toilet natin. And so, I was like, like, I'm gonna put no, a lock in. No, yung walang, walang pintuan. So, I can, in the middle of the night, I can just go in and then like, parang ano. But now I'm seriously reconsidering it. Now I'm my tipinto an okay private That's my lock. space. Oh, um, change na din topic. Kung na tayo mag mag usap about farting. <laughs> ano pa yung mga cringe things that we used to do? How about like when we first started dating? Mm. We were both still in our party phase. It would always be me taking care of you, like you drunk. But I took care of you also twice. <laughs> See, nabibilang ko. Yeah, nabibilang ko. Na. Nabibilang ko yung time na sobrang dead mo talaga. Actually, three times, including our wedding. Okay, yeah. Wedding site. Like, yeah, wow. yeah. But, kasi si Slater, when he gets drunk, it's very different from when I get drunk. When okay. he gets drunk, Paano? he's so normal, 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 normal. And then, he just passes out. That's it. Like, there's no, like, uh. I can tell that you're drunk already, but with me, it's like, okay, here we go, here we go. And it's like, ah! And then I did. Si Chris, mayroon siyang part na embarrassing drunk siya. Yeah, which I stopped, okay? Kasi siya, mahilig siyang maghawk ng bote. Yeah. And then let everybody drink. Yeah, even the if they don't want to drink. Yeah. And alam mo yung irritating friend. Sorry lang. But you know what? Uh, I was 25 then, 26. Alam mo yung irritating friend mo na ayaw mo nang uminom, pipilitin ka talaga. <laughs> this is not good for my mommy image. Parang hindi na to cringe things couples do. Parang... Sisirain natin si Chris. Say the rant about Chris. <laughs> Video. Kanina ka pa ha? May gusto ka ba sabihin sa akin in, in private? <laughs> yep. <laughs> but yeah, so parang... The point was, ano yung mga couple things that you do? So who got drunk in front of who first? Pakute lang sana. Pero who, as usual, inaaway na niya ako. Who got drunk in front of, of who? Um... I think you got drunk first. For sure, it was me. Because I'm such a lightweight. Oh. Like, Naalala ko, three I had to carry you. Uh, the, I, I can't r- forget about this. Laborakai, I had to mm. carry you 
from I think from station one to station two. Station three to station one. Station, station two okay, to station yeah. nila. So, parang ganyan. Like, yeah. sobrang layo. Buti yeah. na lang, andun si Richard Juan. Yeah. <laughs> Hindi namin um, super close at yeah. that time. Oh my God, I'm um, so embarrassed. And then, like, parang sabi niya, bro, tulungan na kita. So, mag <laughs> like, Chris would be on my back and then after a few, like, steps and then siya na naman. And then, yeah, dude, I was dead weight. That was so embarrassing. Let's not go back there. Mm. It's not a couple thing anymore. I regret it. Oh, uh-huh. so yung mga wholesome wholesome mommy image ni Chris ngayon. That was then, this is now. Uh-huh. The past is to be forgotten. <laughs> but I would say... I would ever say, love you. You have a million stories also. Hindi lang kita nilaglag. Uh, but ito, ito, pet oh, peeve ko. Yun lang. O lang daw. Na, yeah, like... <laughs> ito, pet peeve ko sa couples that I've stopped doing, but I used to do. Um, not with you, but there was a time wherein kami sa girlfriend ko Sobrang, we would have our own world. And I, mm-hmm. I think a lot of people can relate. Na, meron kaming sariling mundo that our friends were placed in the background and parang, um, bahala na sila doon. Basta kami may mundo kami. Mm-hmm. And we'll join that group every time we feel like it. But paminsan na lang. And then we'll have like our own thing. Mm-hmm. And I feel like it's, namulat yung mata ko when my, one of my best friends, he actually said, said na, you know what? Every time you have a girlfriend, you forget about the your rest friends. of the world. Your yeah. friends, your family. Kaya nung pag palaging mag, kayo lang magkasama, you have your own time together, you go out together, you don't even reach out. Like, nawawala ka. And that was such a eye-opening moment for me na, oh nga no, um, hindi naman pwedeng yung mundo na yun. Um, kami lang. Mm-mm. So, it was... An eye opener. That's why I never did it when it was with. Oh, kahit Valentine's Day ten kami. Hindi naman. <laughs> yes, love. Double date, double date. Naman, <laughs> no, which is an agreement. no, uh, no. Pero uh, pero yeah. Um, the balance pa rin. The, uh, I mean, meron din ako extreme na meron ako girlfriend and then palagi magkasama sa barkada pa rin. Mm. Pero um, I would say a lot of my past relationships puro talaga favored towards the girlfriend mm. and I it feels very detrimental because every time you need someone, every time you're having a rocky relationship or nagbe-break kayo, andun pa naman din yung mga kaibigan mo, pamilya mo. So, um, that was, I would say, cringe siya in a way we're in. Yun. Na, na take it for granted. Wow, so, mm. sobrang seryoso. Sobrang seryoso niya. Mm. Grabe. After mo akong sirain, Sinabi mo na, I don't really, don't really spend time with her. <laughs> Barkada lang. <laughs> anyway, question ko sa'yo. Sino nag-I love you first sa ating dalawa? I think ako. But I can't, forg- I can't remember din. I can't remember also. You know how like some couples, they really remember like, oh, he said it first and then I didn't know what to say. So I said thank you or say I like you. Diba? We didn't really have that moment. I don't even know. I don't really remember. Uh, I feel like with you, you and I, we got comfy so fast with each other because we mm. were so similar in a lot of ways. Yeah. Yeah, like, okay, Slater told you guys a lot about what I do, but he also does the same. So, like, we're really synced, I feel. Yeah. And so, like, when he said, I love you, I, parang, it's just not a thing, you know? Yeah, I think, like, parang, alam ko nang love mo din ako. Parang ganyan, mm-hmm. I would say. Mm-hmm. But I think, I think it was me first. Like, as, as embarrassed as I may be to admit it, parang, meron naman ding times na looking back, yeah, cringy din mga ginagawa ko. Super cheesy. Like what? You like, are not cheesy at all. Like, I, I think there were moments in our relationship when we first started. Like, para super, ano din, super intimate, super emotional. Hindi naman siya super cringy, but like, mas, mas infatuation phase. Pa Ibalik talaga. natin yan. Ibalik. <laughs> I don't think you would like that. <laughs> Kailangan siguro may transition to like a more mature type of relationship. But you know, um, there are some, because Slater is like not your typical guy. I don't know, typical guy or not. Basta he's not the kind of guy that I'm used to dating because he was yeah. very like, you know, engineer, my mm, kid, whatever, mm. strong. So when there were times that you would surprise me with like, letters mm. right or like i think there was one video that you made for me mm. as a surprise for my birthday mm. that really surprised me like oh my god my sweet bone pala si slater sa katawan niya mm. yeah do i don't know if you find that cringy now looking back no. like you never really wrote me any song or poem or no, i write you love letters but you write me love letters yeah. which is amazing hindi ako poem 
Yeah. Like, parang alive. But that's my love language. Words of mm. affirmation and, yes. and touch. So, mm. very sakto. Like, when you write me letters. Mm. So. Hindi ka nahiya. No. And I like how, even up till this day, si Chris, like, randomly, especially when you have trips na medyo matagal, you'd leave a note. Mm. I keep those notes. You saw that I keep those notes, right? Mm. 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 Sweet, sweet. Ah, ito na naman. Crunch, crunch na naman. <laughs> crunch, crunch. <laughs> what about like, I love, what about like PDA? PDA, um, I've had relationships where it must PDA talaga. Yung batang-bata pa kami. Like making out in public levels? Ay, hindi na, yung sobrang touchy. Yung, I, I don't know if it was making out. Maybe like close to there. Well, yung, yung, yung sobrang first uh, Yeah, first like when you're young and your hormones yeah. are everywhere. Oh, ay parang <laughs> to to the point na yung kaibigan ko, sina sabi niya bihira, bro, grabe naman. <laughs> oh, 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 girlfriend mo na siya. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, yeah, so that's a very cringe thing. Um, sa but, atin ngayon, we're still sweet. We're still Dude, I, f- I feel like with you, I'm super PDA, but it's not like, I won't like make out with you in public, but like, we're always holding hands or like hugging, leaning yes. towards each other. Parang that's very, like to me, it's very PDA because in my past relationships, it wasn't like that. Yes. Yeah. And sometimes, like PDA kayo and you're in that world and some people find it cringy and you don't. Yeah. Diba? So I don't know if what we do, I, hindi naman siguro, pero I don't know if it's hindi mo to makikita. Eh. Maybe it is. Yeah, parang I don't know. Alam love is blind so parang yeah. din. Kasi sometimes when we're with my family or your family we're still like lovey dovey Ay, okay lang naman yun okay lang naman yun pero parang no like in a very formal like chinese dinner but if you were to baby talk me in front of like yeah. everyone like parang iba siguro yung Moms, the thing can you get me some water mm. <laughs> be like oh my god shut up <laughs> Shh, text me well, I, I, I feel like meron tayong konting ganyan when we first started yeah, I mean, I feel like it's part of pakiut, like or like yung yung sabak ba kana ng uh, san, san. I still do that up to this day. San, san, I sit on your lap. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but you do that a lot when we're amongst friends amongst that are friends. super super close yeah. already, like family. Yeah. Um, but like imagine not in if the you, work, not in the workplace. Or like yeah, like <laughs> yeah. there's situations. Yeah. But I don't know if our friends are like ah, that's just like Aaron Chris. Yeah, yeah. For me, naman, di siya cringy. I don't know. Bakadi lang nila siya sa atin. I think, especially <laughs> if butin lang yung friends natin, parang all couples. Yeah. If if hindi sila couples, eh, parang imagine if you're like the only single, or you're all, the only couple amongst your single friends, and like, hey, ito na naman sila. Yeah. Oh. I, no, I think it's fine. Like if you're holding hands or leaning towards each other, but I think it's cringy if you do like like more things like weird things like biting each other's nipples or something. You know what I mean? Like, nipples talaga. No, because I have a friend that does that. Like, literally, she will just like keep biting the guy. So oh, like, yeah, you know what I mean? The other way, the other way around, <laughs> medyo malala. <laughs> each yeah. other's nipples. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> diba? Or like, you know, if it's like bordering sexy, I think that's when it gets cringy. But if it's just like subtle, cute, then I think it's fine. To me. Yeah, but um, I know kasi Especially when you're younger. Hindi mo napapansin. Yeah. Hindi mo napapansin that na ginagawa mo na yun. Yeah. Just, oh, all of our I'm friends. I'm in love. All of our friends have all of these stories and we remember from the past like, oh, I heard you did this, I heard you did that and it's all cringy mm. and we're all not proud of it like even our drunk stories but that's part of life. Cringe <laughs> things happen and they make you grow and mm. it's just fun to look back at. Might be embarrassing, but fun pa rin, di ba? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, what else do we do name? that's cringe that's like the both of us? If people would would know that we do, would y- y- cringe siya. I don't know. We have a lot of things that we do in private that nobody knows. Like how we step on each other's feet up to this day. No, it's you. <laughs> <laughs> no, because there's this thing before we got married. Like somebody told me like you have to step on your partner's feet all the time because mm-hmm. something like... Para, para ano daw, lamang daw siya. Uh, sa para, maan, para yung guy yung para under. So, Hi, so then we had this game where every time like we would see each other barefoot, we would like chase each other and just try to step on each other's feet. Oh, that would be cringe. Like, well, looking at people like, what are, you, what are you guys doing? I don't think it's cringe. I think it's cute. Okay, it's cute for us, but for other people like, oh, there's this couple lang naman. Ito na naman si Slater and Chris. Abaka. I mean, you can't please anyone. You can't please everyone. But you shouldn't live your life trying to please everyone anyway. So, okay. Okay. Lang. okay, okay see, lang see. Yeah. Balance lang. 
Balance lang. And I think these cringe things, embarrassing siya, pero... Okay lang din siya. Okay lang siya eh. Okay lang siya. Oo, oh, magreklamo ng mga Mag- single. Magreklamo lang kayo, okay lang. Basta ako <laughs> Basta masaya. Basta within, within reason. <laughs> Oo. Within reason. But we have, we've had friends na... na We were those couples and meron din tayong mga kaibigan na Mm-mm. wow, grabe. I But, think at the end of the day, kanya-kanya lang yan. Hayaan niyo na lang sila. Let them enjoy their cringe moments. If ayaw mo tumingin, pikit ka na lang. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, live a peaceful life. <laughs>